Hello guys and welcome back to the war of this war of mine. In the previous episode we managed to gather some food. Katya is sad, tired and hungry. It's not the best state to be in. Pavel, however, is feeling better, that's great. Pavel, I'll send you to eat something. Katya, you need to sleep, mate. Bruno slept poorly and is hungry as well. I can understand that, mate. They managed to get that much food. We'll have to sort it very shortly. Let's go in here. Build some medicine. Build some cooking table. Cooking. Simple heater. That's what we need. Or not. Crudel stuff. That's what we need. We need more parts. We have plenty of wood to do it. Well. We will have to eat some raw chicken or whatever it is. And in the meantime, Pavel will have to go and move around in here. And try to discover what we can find there. Maybe we can find more items. Not very feeling, but okay. Well, you just gotta eat something. Slavery probably still hungry. Well, can't help you, Bruno, at the moment. Pavel needs to be working there. You could go, however, build this radio for us. Okay, I will use Pavel to get access to this wardrobe there. Bruno, let's listen to radio. Rebel leader instructed us to warn the listeners not to cross the front line. Failure to comply could result in death. Great. Let's go to beginning and let's see what we can find in here. Any useful information? The upcoming day should still be nice and warm. Perfect for a stroll in the park. Yes, right. That's especially with the shelling around. Because that's what you need. I think there is some more signal coming. Just some music by the looks of it. Some classical music playing. That's fine. What else can we find? Anything of interest in here? Turning, tuning, okay. Okay, that's the instruction from the leader, I know about that. Okay, despite the desperate counterattacks by the rebels trying to lift the siege of the Pogorion, the city remains cut off. Government forces do not allow any aid to reach the city, claiming it would end up in the rebels' hands. It is mostly the case in any war. Music is playing, and unfortunately that's it on the radio, but at least we know the days will be warm. Okay Bruno, let's see if we can create anything of useful there. Can I open that? Oh, we got some diamonds, that's great. I'll send Bruno, maybe I can create some lockpicks. No, doesn't look like it. It looks like it's going to be one of these boring days that we can't really achieve much. Yeah, no, it doesn't completely look like anything we can do in here at the moment. Let's see if I can create at least something useful. Just some fuel from books and timber. It's not much I would like. Okay, so now we can look at the thoughts of our guys. So Pavel says, I hope the elderly people have some family to support them. We should, shouldn't steal from them anymore. I agree, Pavel. I don't really want to do it either. What are you saying? I don't care, care how Katya got supplies. I'm glad she didn't return empty-handed. And what Katya thinks? She's still sad about it. I'm not proud of it, but I had to steal from these poor people. We are in dire need of supplies. We are. Okay, I think we're going to end the day. There is nothing I can do in here. We'll have to send Katya again. Or maybe Pavel this time. Let's see. Looted gas station. Has some food. Old town. Some food as well. Shelled school. Some food. Huge amount of materials. Lots of meds and parts. Supermarket. No. Let's go to Ruin Vina. Some people still live there. Against all odds, they must have some sort of supplies stocked. I think I will send Pavel to looted gas station. 
Okay, we'll send Bruno to sleep in bed. Katya to sleep. And Pavel to scavenge. We really desperately need food and materials. Okay, let's grab the shovel with us. Just in case we need it. And let's go. Looks like people have drained it dry. Well, there's still some materials in here. Hopefully we can fight things. I will take that. There is a car. Let's check it out. Come on, Bruno. Trying to walk slowly so I don't alert anyone if there is some people. There is a lot of materials. I will have to kind of ration it and decide what I really need. I need food. That's the most important thing in here. There is some barricade there. Weapon parts. Oh, there is some food. What's that? Fertilizer. Okay, that's fine. Some cigarettes and coffee. We'll take it. Coffee is a good for bargaining. I'm sure people will be desperate for coffee. Okay, now we're going to make a lot of noise digging through it, but it's a good job we took the shovel with us. It's very helpful. Otherwise, we'll spend half a night doing this thing. I can hear some voices, I think. I have to check it out. Oh, there's an under underground as well. We'll have to check that one out as well. What can we find in here? Well, let's take whatever we can. We'll take that, take that, take this. We can leave herbs. Homegrown tobacco. Do I need it? For now, not. But I really need food, so we may have to come back here tomorrow and take the rest. For now, Pavel will just make sure that the situation is safe in here. Let's take what we can. Leave it. Okay, there is some movement there. I want to make sure that it's not a real person. Sometimes you get rats or cats or other animals. Yeah, rats, that's fine. I can deal with rats. Let's check this out. Some more medicine. I don't need a fertilizer at the moment, so we'll swap that. For medicine, I think. And maybe a cigarette for medicine as well. Never say no to meds. There is a note or something of useful information. There is a note under the table, not actually hidden, but it could be easily missed. From the style and handwriting, I can tell it was written by a woman in Harry. Milosh. I'm sorry, I'm really sorry. I could not wait any longer. I hid some jewelry inside the books. Look for them in the basement, inside the carton boxes behind the buried door. Use it and stay alive, please. God bless you, I'm sorry. Okay. Let's check underground first and then we'll go that way. So they have some jewelry in here. That may be useful for bargain. It doesn't look like Mio is coming home, to be honest. Okay, more parts. Let's see if I can grab anything. No. Can I grab you? Okay, we'll leave it like that. Let's check here. I need food. That's the most important thing I need in here. There is some food. Okay. We'll swap the parts for food. Because I need food more than anything. Clean water. That's also useful. I don't need weapons at the moment, so let's grab all the clean water we can get. Okay, let's go upstairs quickly. I don't think we have to hide in here. We can we can start running because it doesn't look like there is anyone. Unless there is somebody upstairs, but I seriously doubt there will be anyone. It's getting quite late. It's midnight. Okay, open the door. Let's check what is outside. Doesn't look like there is anything. We can go safely. There is something here. That's fine, we can collect that. Some more parts. That's fine, we'll have something to come back for. Awesome, there is something here. This poor man has been caught in the shelling. What was he doing here? Well, I presume that's Milosh. I don't think he will be needing any of this. 
so we'll try to take it from him. Okay, what do we have in here? Plenty of materials, I will have to come back for it. Let's carry on in here and check this out. Come on. Okay, plenty of wood, that's okay. If I need materials, I know where to go. Is there anything in here? Don't know. But Pavel has to kind of hurry up because we are running out of time slowly. There's something here, come on, go get it. What is that? Just the parts, so not much. There is something on the top there, however, so let's go and check that out. And that will be the end of this trip for tonight. What is this? Not much. Okay, we'll have to leave with that, I guess. Or should I just get rid of cigarettes for now? And take more materials, probably. We can always come back for cigarettes later. Okay, I think it's time to run to exit. Let's send him back. There's no point of wasting any more time in here. Okay, the third day of our adventure starts in here. Hello, looks and all the stuff I have. I wish I could bring so much every night. I wish you could as well. We have been raided. Ah, got in and took things by force. We should be waiting there. Katya got slightly wounded, Bruno got slightly wounded. Well, next time I have to put them in guard. Couple of Avenger, but it didn't do much harm. We had some weapons, but not enough for everyone. Katya and Bruno were wounded. And the attackers took few things. We should put more people on guard. We should. We lost some water and some herbs. That's not too bad. Considering all the things I brought in here, it's not tragic really. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this video as well, and we'll try to survive for another day. So for now, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.